milk. While there are many variations of milk on this planet, when somebody in a western country says milk, you can probably assume they are talking about cow's milk. Milk is a major part of millions of people's diets. However, when you think about it, the idea of drinking cow's milk is actually pretty dang weird. So, how did humans end up drinking it? We don't know who the first person to drink milk was, but we do know that that person was European, and they probably crapped their pants a lot. If they wore pants. These early milk drinkers all had lactose intolerance and as a result suffered the effects, which include flatulence, diarrhea, and overall stomach ouchies. Drinking cow's milk wasn't really a thing until roughly under 10,000 years ago, and was only really done by pastoralists. While that is a long time ago, in the grander scheme of humans being on Earth, it's really not. Homo sapiens, aka us, have been on Earth for around 300,000 years, which means we've only been drinking milk for around 3% of human history. So the question is, why did we start in the first place? From a biological standpoint, humans were not supposed to drink milk. In fact, pretty much everybody was lactose intolerant until about 5,000 years ago. This is because milk contained a type of sugar called lactose. When we are babies, our bodies produce an enzyme called lactase, which allows us to consume lactose without any issues. This is important in order for babies to drink their mother's milk. However, as soon as humans stop drinking that milk, they stop producing lactase. Now because of this, for about half of our history of consuming milk, we are intolerant to it. This didn't stop people from drinking it and making products out of it, however. In fact, the first cheeses were believed to have been made around 6,000 years ago. The pros likely outweighed the cons. However, the cons didn't remain cons forever. Humans, of course, evolved. By around 5,000 years ago, a thousand years after people started making cheese, people started being born with the ability to consume lactose without any of the nasty side effects. Evolution, for some odd reason, favored the ability to consume lactose. Not for everybody, however. This evolution happened primarily in Central and Southern Europe. Which is why, to this day, Europeans have the highest rate of lactose persistence, aka the ability to drink lactose without issues, while people in Africa, Asia, and South America tend to be more likely to have lactose intolerance. That doesn't mean that people outside of Europe aren't drinking milk, actually it's quite the contrary. For example, India is one of the world's largest dairy consumers, despite around 60% of Indians being lactose intolerant. Milk today is a staple of many cultures all over the world, even if most of the world isn't technically supposed to be consuming it. Milk is an interesting thing. If you can consume milk, congrats, you are the result of one of your ancient European ancestors making a very odd decision. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, take care.